Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hitman Codename 47 with me, your host Kaiser. We are now going to be doing Traditions of the Trade, which is a mission I absolutely adore and is very Hitman-esque. This mission is incredibly good and I enjoy it terribly. You have to think about it, it's very methodical. It's just such a good mission and I'm glad you guys are here to share in my... Bask is a better word, bask in my joy of this mission. Well, this mission is all about timing. Past, and the thermal bath hotel. What a classy looking place. And well guarded too. It's time to look sharp and concentrate. A good thing I brought my suit. If you're late in any part of this mission, you will not be able to take the targets out as easily as I am about to. Just stay close to my timing, stay close to what I'm doing, and you will be absolutely perfect. I promise. So while we're waiting, doing these small, boring parts, I just want to announce uh, a few videos that are coming to the channel. The Metal Gear Solid LP will be finished in the next 24 hours. Splinter Shell, the complete series, Ghost Perfectionist is on its way. Uh, I'm just planning out a few things before I start, just so I know what I'm going to talk about, and just doing a little bit more research into developers in case I want to talk about them a little more, which is Ubisoft. Um, obviously, there's been some issues I might want to touch on, but still, we are in this game right now. There's also a FIFA LP coming, but that's all I'm saying. So let's just stay on this game. So jump across the balcony as soon as this guy goes in. Take out your fiber wire, crouch, and enjoy the fireworks. Um, anyway, thank you for coming back. I just wanted to do a shout out to a Scorpion HD uh, partner TGN sub to my channel. Thank you very, very much, Scorpion. Right, so timing is now. You need to be perfect. So get this sign. You do not need a weapon right now. The only thing you need to do is that sign and that outfit so you can stand behind this guard. Now there will be a hotel employee coming out of that room and coming into this room. So do not kill this guy until he is in that room. While we're waiting, stick that door on. That door sign on. Do do. Anyway, I hope you're enjoying this LP. I definitely am. That's a little uh, cheat I like to use. Stick everything in my pockets. Sorry if you can hear the clicking in the background. I'm doing it pretty quickly. Empty hands. Get out your weapon. What are you doing? Shoot him in the face, drop the weapons. Both of them. Walk back into here, pick up my suit again. That's my target taken care of. Now we need to take care of this bomb that everybody's panicking about. No. Whoops. There's the door back on. Nothing suspicious happening here, officer. As you saw, I quickly glanced towards the elevator there. That's where we're going a little bit later, but we need to hurry up and be on time for this. If we're not on time, we're not getting this done. That guy will talk to you and warn you about hotel policy and stuff, so that's fine. So just be very, very, very quick. And jump in here. Because your target is sitting in here. Just quickly talk to him. Find out what he has to say. Good thing, Himmler. It is certainly hot in here. Yes. Yeah, well, but I must be careful. I have a weak heart, you see. Don't stay in here too long, then. That's a big hint that you can take him out in here, and that's exactly what we're going to do so we can get the x-ray key. This is a very upper-class hotel, which means medical facilities, saunas, florists. Hey. All things you'll see later. As you can see, his voice changed dramatically there. <laughs> Good job. There we go. That's our target taken care of. So let's go in and get the key. 
Sorted. Now we can just go out and pick up all our stuff. What people here today, I see. Sorted, we've gotten all our stuff back. Now I can just jump into here and run up to our next target, which is getting the bomb. Not a hard part. Just don't mess up. You don't actually have to go up here for the elevator, I just did for some reason. Because I'm weird. Just going on the bottom floor elevator is too mainstream. So go up this elevator and go directly to your left. Nope. To your right. Yep. Second time lucky. So next thing you want to do is run across this roof. Just prepping myself to face for a window. Final didn't work very well, so. So you want to run over here, run past this guy, straight into this room where the bomb is, and pick up the bomb. Okay, now the next thing you want to do is not have that Desert Eagle. Because it will set off an alarm if you do. Let's get my suit back, do this in a traditional Hitman way, full suit and nothing else. No using disguises in one of the games. I'm looking at you. Absolution. I heard about you. But yeah, these games are blind. I just know about the Hitman series from personal experience of people talking about the game. And everyone was talking about this one where you're not allowed to use disguises so for an achievement. So I will be after that achievement because I'm going to be doing this on the hardest difficulty anyway. So that's something to look forward to in the far future when I've finished all the other Hitman games. So be excited, guys! Which and I'll just run out the front door. True Hitman fashion. Nobody knows. Complete, complete ghost. That has to happen, by the way. I just panicked there because I thought I was caught, but I wasn't. If I only had 50 of them in Vietnam, it would still be fresh. I think his nose is very much like mine. A handsome devil. That could be so, Franz. His genetic is derived from the DNA of everyone here. Hold on. Hmm. There's a bit more backstory for us there. Well, thank you so much for watching again. Thank you so much. Look forward to these future LPs of stealth. And I'll see you next time on Hitman Codename 47. Peace out.